Well, hello, all my friends. Welcome back or welcome to the channel. If you're joining us for the first time, welcome. My name is T and this is my channel, Crumpus Tea and Sewing. Please make sure that you follow the link in the description box below to my Instagram account and go over and follow me on Instagram where I post daily. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a unboxing or a fabric haul of fabrics that I just received from Zalu Fabrics. So stay tuned and I'll tell you all about this amazing new fabric company that I am an ambassador for. back so in today's video this is going to be a very special video because I am doing my first unboxing from Zalu Fabrics so this is a fabric company that I have recently uh, started a collaboration with and I will be uh, working with them and sponsoring and they will be sponsoring uh, some of their fabrics to me so this is the very first box that I have received from them and I have not opened it yet. I wanted to share this experience with you all and I hope that you guys really love the fabrics that I have selected to show you. I also have swatches that I have um, ordered from their site as well just to give you guys an idea of what you can expect from this website. Later on after the un unboxing of the video I'll take you through the website and show you how to use the website and then also show you all of the different amazing uh, fabrics that they are selling. So this is a fabric company that has been around for 35 years or more. However, uh, in the past, they were mostly catering to uh, wholesale. Um, they were selling wholesale uh, to larger uh, companies. And they just recently opened um, up a new web, uh, a new website for, um, consumers of all all types of consumers and so uh so now you can actually purchase a lot of their fabrics at retail uh cost as well and so it's a really amazing shop an amazing um fabric uh, store and i can't wait to share with you all the details so with all that said let's get into my first box here's the first box and as you can see it's a pretty hefty one pretty hefty box. So I'm really excited about all of the different fabrics in here. And I hope that you like the fabrics that I selected. Only thing, I didn't tamper with it at all. The only thing that I did was I removed my address label. Um, cause I don't want to show that, but I have not tampered with the box as you can see here. So I'm, this is my first time opening the box. So this is going to be my first impression of the fabrics as well. I've never ordered from this fabric company before. And so this is going to be my first impression of this company. So let's go ahead and open up this box and see what we have. I've been waiting to do this unboxing for several days now. I've had, um, I've had this box for, I think it was delivered to me um, a couple of days ago, but I wanted to save it to do you know a first impression of this particular fabric company so let's see what we have in the box so I have my printout here and it just tells me everything that I ordered on here so the very first piece is this beautiful red scuba knit fabric so let me go ahead and move this box to the side so i can give you a better look at what's going on here so here is the red scuba knit fabric that i ordered it is gorgeous and i am really excited about the texture of this the weight of this i was a little nervous because when you're working with scuba knits there's just so many different types of scuba knits there's techno scuba knits there's um, there's just so many different types um, and they range from lightweight to medium weight and some can even be very heavy but i was looking for something of a little bit more of a medium weight so i could make a jacket and this is perfect for that. It has the right amount of scratch. The color is uh, true to color. 
So um, it's very true to what I was looking at on the internet. So I'm really pleased about this. So that's the first piece and it's really nice, really soft as um, most scuba nets are. So really excited about that piece. Okay, so next we have, this one is an ITY and oh my goodness, this is so gorgeous. Oh, it's even more gorgeous in person. Um, so this is a floral fabric that I had selected to do something for the maxi dress challenge that is coming up. I am going to be doing a maxi dress challenge with Crystal. And um, this is just gorgeous. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous uh, floral print. So this is a, like I said, it's an ITY. It's very drapey um, and most ITYs are drapey and it's very light and fluid. So really looking to uh, making a maxi dress with this. Now this here, this has um, foils or um, what do they call it? I think it's foliage, but it is, it has these really, um, really nice metallic foliage um, going throughout the fabric that is outlined on the fabric. And it's so beautiful. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it is so gorgeous. Really looking forward to making something with this as well. Um, I was thinking maybe the cashmere appleton and turning that into a maxi dress so i was thinking about so doing next that. we have a charmeuse this is a really nice lightweight charmeuse perfect for what i had intended for it um, i'm looking to do a a skirt again for the maxi dress challenge just combining I'm combining a lot of my projects here, but this is um, this is really, really beautiful. And like I said, it's a charmeuse fabric, very lightweight and drapey. So it's polyester. Uh, so it's going to be um, really nice for what I'm, I'm looking for for the summer. So really excited about this. And this piece is also a floral piece and it's uh, purple. And as you can see, it has some green stems in it as well. So I really, really fell in love with the, the flower print on this. Okay, so next I have another scuba knit. So this is um, a sister scuba knit to the red scuba knit that I um, have. And I also ordered a blue one as well. So I'll show you what all those look like. So it's um, the same texture, this one, feels like it has less scratch in it but um it still will work for what i'm i'm hoping to to make uh they also have these little tags on their fabrics as well i forgot to mention that so they have these little tags here that tells you um, how much you ordered the quantity it also has the item number on here just in case you want to reorder it again and then it also uh, tells you a little description of what you purchased and it also has a phone number on here as well so that's very helpful so you can actually call and use the the item number here as well to to reorder that is if you don't want to order it online. So that's very helpful. So here's the Royal Blue Scuba Knit that I was telling you about. Um, very similar to the Lilac and the Red Scuba Knit. Um, again, it doesn't have as much scratch as the Red Scuba Knit, but um, it does have the same texture. It has the same feel. I really love this royal blue. I fell in love with this blue fabric the moment that I saw it and I just thought, oh my goodness. So um, so the plan is to make a lilac, a red, and a royal blue jacket. And I'm gonna be using the same pattern for it. So just to, to have um, different color jackets in my wardrobe to go with my skirts and my dresses and my, my bottoms. So um, really looking forward to that. Okay, next there's another ITY and this is the sister 
ity of the first one that i showed you so this one is on a navy blue background the first one i showed you is on a uh, pinkish background and it has uh, red and um, purple uh, uh, flowers sorry i can't get that out this one is on a navy blue background and it has purple um, blue and lilac type flowers and it's just so gorgeous and it also has that little foliage going around the the flowers which I absolutely love yeah this is just it's a beautiful beautiful um floral print and like I said it's also an ITY and again maxi dress challenge <laughs> this is what i'm going to be using for the maxi dress challenge so again you have that uh, blue tag on on the uh, fabric that gives you the information that you need just in case you want to reorder it i have two more things that i ordered and then we can get on to the squ the swatches okay so this print here i was thinking about doing something for easter for my daughter and myself and this is a blue and purple scuba knit fabric. Um, this one has um, more scratch, as you can see, than the, uh, the three scuba knits that I showed you, um, the, the solid colors. So those are not as scratchy as this one. And... Um, and that's kind of what you get with scuba knits. You just don't know sometimes unless um, you actually read the description. You don't really know how much scratch you're going to get with a scuba knit. They're just, it's just, they, they vary a lot. So, but I really love the print of this. It's very bright and vibrant. And um, I love the give in this. It's just a, such a beautiful print. Let's see if I can open it out some more so that I can show you the pattern here so it's just such a, a beautiful beautiful print yeah this is a gorgeous fabric and I'm just really impressed so far with um, the fabrics that they have uh, on this site and like I said this is my first time um, ordering anything from this fabric company and I'm very very impressed uh, with these fabrics okay lastly I uh, got a, a poplin fabric so you guys know I could not pass up any kind of cotton because cotton is my favorite uh, fabric to work with this poplin fabric right here oh this fabric caught my heart as soon as I saw it online so this is a poplin fabric and by the way I am very impressed with uh, the feel the texture the colors are so vibrant um, so this is a poplin fabric that's on a black background it's a floral fabric the floral um, details are um, like a really light orange uh, you have some pink some different hues of pink um, there's even white flowers a uh, little bit of um, tan around the flowers it's just a gorgeous gorgeous print and really love it um, and it's also one of these um, a, a bright piece that I think is um, perfect for fall like I always like uh, floral designs that's on a muted or dark background so I just love the combination and I I'm sure that I've told you all this before but I love that uh, that combination of you know dark you know transitioning from dark to light and so I really like dark backgrounds and um, and really bold and vibrant prints so this really attracted me um, and the fact that it is poplin um, and cotton, it's, it's, um, it's one of those things that I really, really love. So beautiful, beautiful. And this, I'm thinking about making a skirt and a matching top with it. So really impressed with this, uh, the, the fabrics here. Um, they are more than what I've been, in, more than what I have expected. Um, I really love the feel, the quality of these fabrics, and I am 
looking forward to making something amazing with these fabrics. All right, so let's look at these swatches of fabric. So here's the first here. Um, really nice. I think this is a brocade. Yes, this is a um, embellished uh, floral jacquard. So really nice um, black and, and tan fabric here really gorgeous so it has this um this really nice pattern here it's um like an abstract design really beautiful fabric so that was something that i was thinking about purchasing so let's put that on to the side i also got a similar piece here this is the same um uh, fabric it's just a different color so this one is green and black so again is a um, jacquard fabric a really nice texture really beautiful jacquard I really like this and this would have been good for like St. Patrick's Day or something like that I'm not Irish and I don't really celebrate but um, that would be a, a perfect fabric for that now, the last fabric that I showed you with the black background and the floral detail, this is um, the same fabric. It's just a different color. So it's a poplin cotton and it is, um, it's on a peach background and it has pink flowers um, and white flowers, green stems. So I was really um, wanting to see what this fabric looks like before I got it because like I said I'm more of a fan of darker backgrounds and bright florals and so I wanted to see if this would be something that I actually would like and it's very beautiful I really like it so again it's cotton it has a little bit of scratch it has like that natural cot that scratch that cottons have so very beautiful Here's another um, ITY. So this again is a sister fabric of the ITYs that I picked up. So remember I picked up the one with the navy blue background with the purple florals and then also the peach background or it's like a pink, a pinkish background with red and pink florals. So this one is also a, um, a sister fabric to that. And again, it's a ITY fabric and it has uh, floral designs and it has that same, the, the foliage um, going around the, fa the flowers. So really gorgeous fabric. Okay, so this next um, swatch that I picked up, this is um, a Chinese Mikado. I think that's how you say it, Mikado or Mikado uh, fabric. And um, it's kind of similar to a, it reminds me of a, um, not a jacquard, like more of a brocade fabric, but it has more of a, like you can really feel the polyester, that texture, you know, like that. If you can hear that, you can actually hear it and see it and feel it. But it's gorgeous fabric, and this is fabric for usually for like special occasions. Um, and I think that that's really gorgeous. And it also will serve really well, I think, as uh, drapes. So like if you want to make you um, like some drapes for um, summer or for fall, I think this would be light enough um, to to make uh, some drapes with as well. So this particular piece is navy blue and white. And it um, those this is a flower plant so really gorgeous so this next piece is a um this is a they call it a power sateen so it's a sateen uh, fabric and <clears throat> it does have stretch in it so it stretches quite a bit and I really like this and they have um, several different colors, including like blue. I think they even have like a, a um, like a brown type color. 
um, I, I can't remember all the different colors that they have, but this one here, I really, um, it really attracted me because I'm going with this purple theme. And so it's really gorgeous. It is a sateen fabric, um, but it has like this, um, this light sheen on it as well. Um, I don't know if that's coming up or not, but it's a gorgeous, gorgeous fabric. And that's another one that I have been thinking about purchasing as well. Next, I had um, picked up this jacquard fabric. It's similar to the first two that I showed you, the, the green. So this one and this one, it is um, the same fabric. It's just a different color. So this one is gray and black instead of green and black and um, tan and black. This one's gray. Um, same thing as a jacquard fabric, very beautiful texture. And as most jacquards, they have a little bit of a stiff drape, but you know, they're perfect for special occasions. And then lastly, I picked up a, this is a cotton fabric that is, um, it has an embroidered print and it's really, really beautiful. I love the print here the embroidery detail on this. And so I thought this would probably be good as a nice little summer dress, but this is very lightweight and um, it's very transparent. So I, you would have to line it. So, um, so I'm glad I actually um, got a, a swatch of this so I could see what I'm looking at and what um, I would need to do with it because you do need to line this, but it's a gorgeous, gorgeous fabric very smooth texture. I really love the, the embroidered details as I stated before. And, um, I think it'll be fun. So yeah, so that is my fabric haul for this particular, um, video. And I, I had fun with the unboxing. I hope you all had fun too, looking at all of the new fabrics that I received from Zulu Fabrics. And um, I am an ambassador for this company now, and I will be working with them and collaborating with them from now until, um, and, and well into the future, hopefully. And um, I have a coupon code that is, um, it doesn't expire as long as I am collaborating and working with this company. It never in expires. I'll make sure that I put that here in the video and also in the description box below. I'll also make sure that I put the link to Zulu Fabrics in the description box below as well. So you can go over and check out the uh, awesome website that they have and all of the different fabrics that they have available for you to purchase. And with all that said, I'm going to go ahead and, um, and show you a quick run through through the site and show you how you can sign up and also, um, you know, sign up for their, their newsletter and then also how to browse the site and um, try to look around and see what you, what you would like and also to see what they have to offer. Now, I want to also say that um, if you use my coupon, if you use my coupon code, I will uh, get a small commission off of whatever you purchase. So um, if you um, like the fabrics over there, please make sure that you purchase something. It will really help me out. And then also, in addition to using my coupon code, when you sign up for the first time for their newsletter, you get, I believe it's 15% off. And so with the 15% off and my uh, coupon code, uh, you can use those jointly. And so for your first uh, purchase, Purchase, you're looking at somewhere between 20 to 25% off of your purchase. All right, so with all that said, let's go ahead and browse their site. At the Zulu Fabrics um, website. And as you can see up here in the top left-hand corner, I am not signed in, but you can sign in and create an account. Um, if you are an existing customer, you can just go ahead and put your email and password in and sign in. If not, on the right-hand side, you see right here, it talks about um, um, your new customer status. And so if you want to place an order, you can also contact, here's the number, or you can also email um, info at zalufabrics.com. It talks about um, accounts can be made for both uh, wholesale as well as retail customers. 
and um, if um, you want to have a wholesale account um, you will need to uh, get approval for um, from the management team so but you can also um, apply um, um, right here at this um, apply now so if you click the apply now um, it'll just take you to this new customer page where you can fill out your name your address and create a password and you just go ahead and you apply and when you apply you will receive an email and you will get that um, that 15% off your first uh, purchase for um, creating a um, an account with them and um, applying for their newsletter all right so in terms of fabrics as you can see here up at the um, at the top where the black bar is um, this is your menu and so you have um, the fabric types if you click on that menu you'll see the different fabric um, selections that they have uh, which are blue, blue clay they have CDC um, fabrics they have chalet charmeuse chiffon cotton crepe DTY DT eyelet um, they even have lace fabrics they have mesh fabrics, Makedo fabrics, organza, uh, poly knit, just a, an array of different fabrics. You have your cottons, you have your poplins, you have um, scuba, sang tongue, just an array of different knits that they have here to offer. So we're going to click on just one of these so that I can show you what they have to offer here. So let's do, let's do scuba. So here is their scuba selection. So the red techno fabric that I um, received is this uh, fabric right here, which is the item number 5566. And as you can see, it's $4.99 a yard. So it is on sale. The original price is $5.99. So let's click on it. And you'll see when you click on it, um, they have different colors that you can order as well. So here is a blue one. Um, they also have a black that you can order as well. Um, they have yellow, lilac, green, orange. And then if you scroll down to the bottom, you'll see a number of different things. Um, on the left, you'll see here there's a video where you can actually... Um, see them demonstrate the stretch and the uh, feel of the fabric um, and the drape of the fabric as well. On the right hand side here you can see um, the different quantity sizes that you can order in order to receive a discount. So if you buy um, one to nine yards of it it's $4.99. If you buy 10 to 49 um, you get 5% uh, off and instead of $4.99 you'll be paying $4.75 and so on and so forth. So the more you buy, the more you save. Um, down, um, further down, you can see that you can actually enter in how many quantities you want of the product. And then in red, it also tells you how many yards are left in stock and also to uh, contact uh, Zulu Fabrics um, for um, order production or bulk, bulk in inquiries. So if you want to um buy in large quantities you do need to contact them you also can you also can um add this to your wish list here so if you um tap on that um you see a little black heart will appear and it will be added into your wish list you can also see more details of the fabric as well. As you can see, this particular fabric consists of 95% polyester and 5% spandex. It also has the weight of the fabric as well as the width of the fabric and the origin of the uh, fabric as well. And it gives a little uh, description of what a scuba knit is and what you are going to be expecting from this particular fabric. Um, if you go further down, You'll see um, similar fabrics and similar styles here that they have in a little uh, slideshow down here. They also have a menu bar for uh, the fabric base. So if you want it as a solid, a print, 
yarn dye or novelty you can select any one of those choices and you can narrow your search um, you can search by fabric style which is knit woven or embroidery you can search by fabric color black blue brown gold green gray and etc you can search by embellishments so depending on what kind of embellishments you want on your fabrics you can search by embellishment types you can search by pattern type if you want to abstract abstract florals if you want animal if you want uh, bias repeating prints border prints check checker prints chevron etc you can also shop the sales So it's a beautiful, beautiful site, and um, I'm really um, overjoyed that I will be working with Zulu Fabrics. I have been very impressed, very impressed with the fabrics. Um, I haven't worked with them yet, but I'm very impressed by the feel of them. My first impression is um, I, I really, really love the the fabrics. So again, um, create an account. If you create an account and you sign up for the newsletter, you get the 15% off. And then if you use my coupon code on top of that, you will receive um, another 10% off of your purchase. And remember, the 15% off is a one-time um, deal for when you apply to the newsletter. However, my 10% coupon is something that you can use so long as I am working with them so um, so you can go ahead and save that that coupon code in and shop throughout uh, the year so yeah I'm really excited about this oh the one thing I wanted to say as well is um, you do get um, if you look all the way up here at the top here um, you do get free swatches here. I'll highlight that here. You do get free swatches and free shipping on all U.S. orders that are over $60 as well. So that is something to keep in mind as well, um, that if you, um, if you want free shipping or anything like that, as long as your order is over $60, you get that free shipping and then you also get the free swatches as well. So, yeah, um, let me know in the comment section below what you think of the unboxing as well as um, the website. And if you have ordered from Zulu Fabrics before, let me know. Drop me a line. Tell me what you thought of um, you know, what was your first impression of their fabrics. Um, I really love them. And um, I'm, I can't wait to make my first make with it so I can actually give you uh, more of a review of the, the fabrics themselves. So, uh, yes, yeah, stay tuned for that, and I am excited to, to share my progress and everything with you as I continue to work with this fabric company. All right, everyone, so that does it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed yourself. If you did, make sure that you give this video a big thumbs up, and don't forget to like the video, and, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and also hit the notification bell so you can receive notifications of all my videos when I post them. All right, everyone, until next time, stay creative. Bye.